Today is Monday, August 21st, 2017, and I think that the solar eclipse is starting really soon. Right now it is 2.32, so it's starting in about 12 minutes, and I just wanted to start vlogging because I think, I don't know, I can't really tell, but I feel like it's starting to get maybe a little bit dark outside, so I'm wondering if I should quickly put some clothes on and then when it starts like reaching totality I should run outside to film it but I'm also afraid of accidentally looking at it because we didn't bring we didn't buy any glasses or anything yeah I'm just I don't know I don't know if that's dumb but I'm afraid that I'm gonna accidentally look at it and damage my eyes or something so I'm kind of worried like maybe I should just stay inside it's super hard to tell but um yeah I feel like it's starting to get a little dimmer I'm so excited <laughs> I think totality is in like four minutes. It's a little bit darker outside and the temperature went like way down. All right, it's the moment of totality. And as you can see, the lights came on. It's not very noticeable on camera, but it is like a little bit darker outside. All right, so this has been Caitlin reporting to you live from Fayetteville, North Carolina. Um, as you can tell, it wasn't like that amazing or anything. The sun was very much still visible in the sky and I even heard that you could look at shadows on the ground during the moment of totality and they would be in like a crescent moon shape. But even the shadows still looked the same. <laughs> Pretty jealous of you guys in Oregon because you were right in the path of where the eclipse was going to hit and look really awesome. So looking forward to your vlog on Wednesday. I hope you got some really good footage of that. I will say one of the weird things that happened was just that the temperature dropped, which for Fayetteville is kind of freaky actually because it's normally like 90 degrees here in the summer during the day and it dropped, I want to say to like the 70s, but yeah. It was, it was interesting, a little bit exci of excitement for the day. Thursday morning. Time to sit down with a big cup of tea and watch one of Ross's vlogs. I'm so excited. What? Holy shit. your vlog a lot because it like captured everything that you did and honestly like my last vlog was four minutes long and I put like a movie review in it and I couldn't even put in the whole movie review of like stuff I wanted to say because I had to make too short of a video I don't know maybe we should revoke the rule of four minutes because number one it's been really really hard to edit videos that are under four minutes number two the whole point of our vlogs is to like see what the other person is doing because like I'm not there to like hang out with you and you're not here to hang out with me so I don't know like 
I originally made that rule because I thought like, oh, the vlog brothers are people that we look up to and kind of like inspired the whole sibling video idea, but their types of videos are different from ours. Like they sit down, like I was talking to Sam about this the other day and he was like, well, the vlog brothers, they like sit down and talk about a certain topic which I think is awesome and maybe we could do videos like that in the future when we have like not much going on but um, our videos are different ours are like lifestyle type vlogs like this is what's happening in my life like events and the vlog brothers don't really make videos like that so maybe we shouldn't follow that rule maybe we should just kind of let our videos be as long as we want as long as they're not like ridiculously long like over 20 minutes yeah, I don't know. I can't think of a punishment. So, you know what? Let's just disregard those like Vlogbrothers type rules that we made up before and let's just do our own thing, man. Because we are different from the Vlogbrothers and we are our own people. <laughs> so, I think that we should have a rule that's. We should have rules different from theirs. We should be able to make vlogs as long as we want. Um, I don't think that there should actually be punishments. Although, I don't know, you were, like, curious to see what sort of punishment I would come up with. Yeah, I've honestly been sitting here for, like, five minutes trying to think of a punishment and I cannot think of one. So, you know what, just, like, live your life, man. Don't have any sort of punishment. Just be yourself. <laughs> Living in the sunlight, loving in the moon, <laughs> the one 